This is Shelley Kraft coming to you live on SNN Live. We're coming to you on location in New York City. I have with me Rafael Gutierrez of Ascent Solar. It's a publicly traded company, and the symbol is A S T I. Rafael, welcome to SNN Live. Thank you, Shelley. It's good to have you. Let's get into it. Give us an overview on Ascent. Sure. Ascent Solar uh, actually is a combined company. It's, it's both a solar company as well as a consumer electronic solution company. We're based outside of Denver, Colorado, uh, in Thornton. Uh, we have about 150 uh, employees, and we serve two markets, uh, really. We serve the solar market uh, on a specialties. I'll break it down here in a moment. And we also serve consumer electronics, very exciting products relative to portable power, as well as outdoor power, as well as mobility power. Is this proprietary technology that was developed inside the company? Yes, it is. Uh, so we have, we're really a six company, uh, known as copper, indium, gallium, selenide. It's more metals than anything else. Uh, but in reality, the company has an incredible product. It's flexible solar uh, on plastics, and it's actually extremely thin. It's about 50 micron on thickness. So now let's get into the products a little bit. So, you know, I, I, you know, I don't want to, you know, you tell me. Sure. Uh, let's first talk about solar, per se. Uh, we do a specialty products. Uh, and let me just address some of the markets we play in. Uh, uh, we play on aerospace and drones. Uh, we play on military applications, as well as transportation. But also a segment called uh, BIPV, which stands for Building Integrated photovoltaics. Uh, these markets are growing at an incredible pace, especially the drone market, as well as transportation and others. We're beginning to see the electrification of transportation uh, right now. Uh, and you can see it in the streets with Tesla uh, having actually a battery card, but you can see now a lot of charging stations that most likely will move into solar uh, solutions. Uh, relative to the other solar pieces, um, we we actually addressing uh, the upcoming drones. Uh, because of our weight uh, on the solar is extremely light, uh, we see a num numerous applications. We're now designing with a Silent Falcon. It's a fixed wing, actually, drone. And we're very pleased to be the supplier for Silent Falcon. So here's what I want to know now. <clears throat> Consumer market. Give me an idea of what you're talking about. Oh, very excited. I'm glad you asked the question. <laughs> uh, you know, the consumer side, uh, we actually offer both solar solutions. It's about charge it, collect it rather, from solar, charge it, and use it. Uh, on, on, the, on the consumer side, we are addressing three markets. One is a mobile market. It's consumer electronics. It's batteries. We all run out of power uh, with our phones here and there. Uh, number two is outdoors, and uh, number three is emergency, which is actually a new category that is just emerging right now uh, with non-fumes, meaning big batteries that you can use at home. Let me illustrate the mobile market for a moment. We have products that range anywhere from a phone case to a battery that you can charge multiple devices like an Android and an iPhone simultaneously. Uh, all the way up to high batteries that are over basically a thousand watts. So, so we, you're talking about sun power turning into electric charges for mobile devices. So how does that work? Well, it actually trickle charge the battery, so it's it's pretty elegant. But it's about you know on the on the mobile side. I mean, so, some of these devices we keep it in our pockets. So solar is an emergency device. Right. But on the outdoors, is critical because you don't have any access to an outlet. So we have solar solutions that can actually, as very small solar panels, that can actually charge your phone at the same speed of an outlet, for example. But mobile power is growing at a 47% CAGR, which is very rapid growth. So like laptops in the field, I, I mean, you know, you, you know, you get me going, you know, I'm starting, you know, while you're talking, I'm thinking about all the products that this could be used on, especially outdoors, you know, I, I mean, uh, well, I'm taking your thunder again, <laughs> but continue, please. No, no problem. So, you know, let, let's, let's dial back for a moment. So on mobile power, 
you know, it's a big market. It's about ten uh, billion dollar market, uh, growing at forty seven percent CAGR. Uh, very excited to be in the category. Uh, rapid growth. We have some incredible products. We have credit card size batteries, all the way up to ten k milliamp hour batteries that can charge your, you know, tablets as well as mm -hmm. your uh, mobile phones. Uh, on the on the center for us is is really a lot of applications for outdoors. And this is where solar really comes in as a, as a large player because we can charge our devices so you can be outdoors for weeks, okay? We had an ambassador actually that was in uh, Everest when the earthquake occurred and he came out on TV and actually uh, we were very pleased that all our products actually saved lives when he was there. So extremely excited. Uh, the outdoor market is growing very rapidly. I think you're going to see wearables in the future as part of that solution. So our solar solutions are a perfect fit for that. Emergency, and let me just touch base on that, emergency is a new category for batteries. So typically people have to buy a generator, but you cannot use a generator inside your home. So now you can actually get batteries that you can charge with solar or with an outlet that if you have a big ice storm in the Northeast, you can actually run your refrigerator for quite a few hours and run lamps and fans and charge your portable devices and so forth without any smoke inside the house. It's and pretty it exciting. sounds like it's not gonna be ridiculously expensive either. It's not, it's not. It's uh, pretty affordable and practical because you know they weigh 40 pounds, you can move it around just like uh, I don't know, like a printer. <laughs> I'm going to ask you, what's your background? Uh, my background is, uh, you know, I used to uh, work in the storage industry. So in the past, I worked for Seagate Technology as well as Micron. Uh, I worked for Ascent several years back and came back. Okay, just came back uh, this year. I'm very excited to be back. Where does the technology come from? Uh, the technology is a combination of... Uh, the, let's divide it up. So the solar technology uh, came, originated in a company called ITN uh, in Colorado, which is actually an incubator of, of new technologies, especially mm. for solar. Mm. Uh, that technology was actually what drove Ascent Solar as, as a company. Uh, the portable power pieces is a combination of both our IP as well as so, some other ODMs outside the U.S. Hmm. Listen, let's get your website out there for more information, if you wouldn't mind. Absolutely. Uh, the solar website, the main website for us is www.sendsolar.com. Uh, and on the consumer side is www.goenerplex.com. Ladies and gentlemen, Rafael Gutierrez, Ascent Solar. It's a publicly traded company, and the symbol is A S T. Hi, I'm Shelley Kraft. This is SNN Live, and we're coming to you on location from New York City. Raphael, let me thank you for coming on. Thank you for having me. You guys.